I would like to extend warm holiday greetings to FAMA members around the world. It's been a very important and exciting year for our organization, and I want to thank each of you for the role you've played in ensuring our continued growth and success. I'd like to take a few moments to share with you some of our most important achievements of the past year. In 2013, IFAMA hosted a successful World Forum and Symposium in Atlanta, Georgia, where more than 400 people joined together to engage on the subject of talent in the context of global food and nutritional security. We were proud to have more than 150 academic research papers presented by leading academics from more than 30 countries and 24 student case competition teams representing more than 10 countries. Congratulations again to our winning team from Santa Clara University. During the past year, we engaged in a strategic planning process in partnership with Boston Consulting Group. This process was undertaken to position IFAMA for long-term, sustained success, and through it, we examined current programming platforms and potential new areas of stakeholder engagement and how we can expand the value we are delivering to our membership. In 2013, IFAMA made the decision to relocate our business office from College Station, Texas to Washington, D.C. We want to say thank you to our colleagues at Texas A&M who have been generous hosts to our organization on their campus over the years. We believe the new location will provide greater synergies and opportunities to more directly engage with global partners in government, NGOs, academia, and industry. Thanks to the leadership and commitment of Catherine White and Dr. Peter Goldsmith, IFAMA's peer review journal, the IFAMR, continues to thrive. The journal receives nearly 20,000 downloads per month, and submissions are at record highs. The first special issue of 2014 will focus on Africa in support of the 2014 World Forum. The next IFAMA World Forum in 2014 will take place in Cape Town, South Africa, and we look forward to welcoming each of you there in June 2014. Work is well underway to make this our best annual event ever. The format of our 2014 event will include uniquely immersive and interactive workshop sessions, demonstrations of cutting-edge technology, and facilitated discussions by world-renowned speakers. 2014 will mark Athama's 25th anniversary, and we're looking forward to celebrating this milestone with you throughout the year. Our work together in Athama is very important. We're the only truly global organization focusing on raising the professionalism of agribusiness and developing the talent pipeline necessary to feed the world today and in the coming decades. I want to close with a few words spoken by Nelson Mandela, a truly great and visionary leader that we said goodbye to this year. The life of Mandela inspires the entire world today as it will for generations to come. He dedicated himself to achieving unity, peace, and a greater good for all. And he understood that knowledge empowered people. This is highly relevant to our mission at Afama. In the words of Mandela, education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. As we move towards our time together in South Africa, we will take inspiration from the legacy of Mandela to consider how developing talent can mobilize people to feed the world. Happy Holidays and Happy New Year to you and your family, and I look forward to seeing you in Cape Town in 2014.